All right, brothers and sisters of this celestial energy, brother wisdom, what's going on, guys? All right, um, this is a frequency generator. Uh, this is an app that I pulled up, um, and I love mess talking with dealing with frequencies. I'm always talking about frequencies. Um, this is a dual frequency generator. This is the uh, Kui dual channel function generator. Um, I've got it hooked up to my uh, um, amplifier here. I got it hooked up to my amplifier. I got a speaker here, and then I have a, another speaker there. My workshop is kind of messy here. You can see I got all kind of stuff here in my workshop. It's really messy, but, you know, kind of strange. I know where everything is. <laughs> it's really strange. I know where everything is. Um, this frequency generator. As you can hear the frequencies, it's being emitted. All right. Let me see if I can turn it up a little bit. And this is a 296 hertz, and I'm still using the AM. Now, if I go to FM, that's the FM. All right, I hit the AM. All right, so you have the, the FM hertz and the AM hertz. Now, you have to remember that the hertz that are being used um, by these inorganic beings are FM hertz. They use FM hertz. Um, for much of everything, the AM Hertz is actually used to generate certain energies. So I've got it 296. So I'm going to change it to 432 Hertz. Okay, and it's a dual thing. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, I'm going to make this 423 Hertz. And one channel is, is, let's change that over there. There it goes. All right. So I got one at 360 degrees and the other one at, um, 78.9 degrees. And that 360 degrees is is actually when what happens right here, the 360 degrees, it's actually looping an, an energy at, three, at a 360 degree value. This is looping the energy at the frequency at 78.9 degree value. Okay, let's see here. Let me change that there. Um, no, we want to go to phase, 78.9. We'll change this right here. One change to 99. Ooh, bring it down, bring it down. Ooh, I'm sorry. We'll bring it down. A little bit too high. 99.8, 99. We're going to go 99.9. That's where we're going to go. That, and we're going to go to channel two. It's at a phase of a 360 degree. So I got a 99.9% phase for 99.9 um, .9 degree phase of channel one. And for channel two, I'm going to the 360 degree phase. And this is creating this frequency here. Now, these frequencies are important because when you're dealing with um, different structures that you're building, building and you enclose... Um, you have this structure enclosed and you turn these frequencies on. These frequencies literally create energy inside of the structures. All right. So let's go to the frequency here and we're on channel two and we're going to change the value. Okay. To uh, 598 Hertz. Now if we change the FM, listen to the FM. These are the frequencies that you can't hear that's way up in the air, the FM hertz, that really makes things really, really horrible for the atmosphere. Okay? You want a steady frequency. So, our ancestors used the AM frequencies. So I change the AM, and when I change the FM, watch what happens. Science! This is all about science, brothers and sisters.
change that back. Okay, so that's the 598. Now, what happens when we, let's change the frequency here. Let's change this frequency to a um, six, no, 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 no. Um, hold on, we're gonna cancel that out. Oops, and value. I'm gonna change this frequency to 999. Let's see if 999 hertz. There you go, there. You hear that? Now, if you have this in an enclosed area, a structure that you built, in a closed area, this frequency will cause everything to vibrate on a high note. Remember, we were talking about frequencies, and we were talking about now we were talking about the high frequencies, which will be the positive frequencies. This will be up there with the the crystallized frequencies, the the positive frequencies, and this frequency is literally traveling um, uh, 999 hertz per second. All right. And um, remember, hertz is based upon one second. All right. When you talk about her terahertz, you're talking about trillions. So this is per second. You got nine nine hundred ninety nine cycles um, that is traveling um, clockwise. All right. They're traveling clockwise per second. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to change the frequency. Okay. And we're gonna change this frequency to a 296 hertz. Now this frequency, which is a lower frequency, has changed its direction and now is traveling, all right, 296 cycles per second, because you remember 296 hertz means per second is traveling 296 cycles per second counterclockwise all right so the, the lower the frequency the um the more powerful it, it says the more the, the the lower the frequency the the more powerful the energy so let's change this let's let's go and change this down here let's take this down to a 99 we're gonna take it to a 99 hertz Hear that? That's that ohm. Mm -hmm. That's that ohm. Mm -hmm. Let's change the FM. Very dangerous frequencies. FM. Broken frequencies. This is what they use to uh, really mess with our minds, all right? This is a whole frequency. So the lower the frequency, now this frequency right here is traveling 99 cycles per second at a counterclockwise, um, in a counterclockwise motion, all right? So just a little, you know, just a little science. Science behind everything, brothers and sisters. We've been talking about frequencies here. So, um, this is the frequency generator. I'm using my tablet. Um, I got it downloaded on my tablet. But it's the frequency generator. Um, let's see. We're going to change the value of this frequency here. We're going to go different. We're going to go even deeper. Let's go 33 hertz. You can't hear it. It's so deep, you can't hear it. All right, so we're gonna take it up to 55 hertz. Can you hear that? That's 55 hertz. I'm gonna change the waveform. So let's take it up to 66 hertz and see what we get. I'll take the 66 hertz.
And we can use these frequencies inside of our structures and with the proper building and the proper crystals and metals inside of the structures, these frequencies can cause everything to vibrate at a certain temperature. I mean, at a certain temperature and a certain um, degree, right here, um, at a certain degree, which right here we still have, is still in uh, 360 degree wave right here. Still in a 360 degree wave. And I still have this at 430, 423.26 hertz. Um, so because, because there's a dual function right here. So both of them are moving at the same time. But this is at a lower hertz of, I mean, at a lower degree of 99.9 degree. Um, uh, to conference um, radi radi radio degree, if I got that right. Um, but what, what it is, is these frequencies play a definite role in your structures. All right. So when you have something enclosed, but what they're using, this is the FM. Uh, okay. I want to go back to the channel two. Let me see that the FM. A lot of times they use, this is what the dangerous frequencies that they use that you can't hear. And it's being pushed out into the atmosphere through what they call satellites. All right. Understand what's going on. All right. So this is a little something about, you know, frequencies, science, this is frequency generator. I like working with them. Um, and I'm going to be um, building me some speakers so that um, I can... Um, the device that I'm planning on making, I can use that device and um, see how it works in the atmosphere. Okay. Thought I'd share that with you guys. All right. Catch you guys a little later.